notebook thing right here. And this is nice. You can change the angle. That little hook. Adjust this, turn it, turn this up and down, angle that. And this has two uh, different speeds. So I'm a fan. Get it? I'm a fan. <laughs> but this little guy, this Ryobi fin is perfect for my van. Now it's nice and neat in here. I still gotta like vacuum it out again probably for my next moving job. Probably do that. I might also come in here and just brush everything down because you can kind of see dirt in here. And if someone has some white furniture, if we move white furniture in here, it's gonna definitely be um, collecting some of that dirt you can really see it on this side more and you might be looking and thinking it's just like oh it's part of the bin it's like dent or whatever no this is literally dirt where so kind of critical I'll probably get a rag and just maybe brush it all down um, I hadn't done a big moving uh, yard work job in, in a while, so the one I did recently obviously played a toll, getting it nice and dirty and dusty in here. So I've only had like one actual move, others have been um, kind of disposal, um, disposal gigs, so I've been fortunate in that sense. But I want to be respectful and considerate of my customers and make sure they have some nice furniture it's not getting all especially couches and stuff like that if it's white or tan we don't want it to get dirty so gonna be doing that but this fan that's what this was supposed to be about so maybe i'll make this one longer video on um doing a little review on this ryobi fan because i think this is perfect for my van um it's only gonna get hotter in here got my little seats here it's only gonna get hotter in here in the summertime so having that fan is gonna be a game changer and the fact is it comes with these batteries that you can see right here that work with my, um, what did I just purchase? Uh, oh, the reciprocating saw that Ryobi makes. Um, so I bought two of these batteries and then I can basically get the fan for free. Um, and then the batteries also work for the saw as well as the fan and my other emergency um, uh, drill. So props to Ryobi. Um, something to consider is the warranty though. If you do have a um, Ryobi products and you're, you're, doing, you're using their tools for commercial work, I don't think the warranty is, uh, covers it for commercial work. So something to consider. But um, Ryobi's pretty affordable compared to other equipment. And they have tons of different tools and things like that. So I'm a fan of, I'm a fan of the fan, as you can see. And um, you know, definitely got to make sure your workspace is nice and clean and you are able to work effectively and efficiently. And um, yeah, so I think we'll probably wrap up this video now that Bessie's nice and clean, good to go for the next job. Oh, we got to turn the fan off. Which is just a little flick of the switch. Man. But I'm curious to hear what you guys think about my workspace. What do you think about how she's currently set up? Do you guys clean after jobs? Do you clean, you know, right before jobs? 
Do you have a fan inside your van? Or how do you keep cool? If you have a, uh, an Ego, what am I saying, an Ego? A uh, E250 Ford cargo van, you probably struggle with the same issues that I struggle with in the summertime, especially here in Boston. It can get nice and toasty in here. It's like a sauna. So that fan hopefully will be a game changer. At least with helping to circulate the air, you know. So let me know what you guys think. Feel free to leave a comment down below. And um, yeah, with, I'm anxious to hear what you guys think about my, my setup, my work band setup. Do you like it? You're not a fan? Any recommendations? What do you think I can do to help make my workspace? What do you think I can do to help make my workspace better? That is the question. Feel free to leave a comment down below. Like this video if you haven't yet. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell. And of course, much appreciation for you guys spending some time with me on this uh, beautiful afternoon. And uh, lastly, as usual, how can I help you?